Premiership player, Jock Addy, playing a different role, went back to the VFL for a few weeks and had to learn at times playing down back, at times playing on the wing, and he's worked extremely hard out there. I sort of had a bit of a frustrating first half of the year, um, playing as a forward. Uh, yeah, we obviously had a lot of sort of ups and downs as a team with um, a lot of injuries and wasn't in real good form. And then Jack came back into the side and there was obviously him and Lynchy and myself. Dustin was spending a lot of time there and Dimmer sort of said, mate, obviously like playing our little small forwards and we might have to sort of look for another position for you. There might not be sort of any more space in the forward line for um, someone like you. So we're going to play up on the wing um, and we're unfortunately going to play in the VFL for a little bit to, to have a go at that. And so yeah, it was a bit it was sort of Disappointing to hear first up, obviously every AFL player is here to play AFL, not VFL, but went back and really enjoyed, really enjoyed playing those two games in the VFL. Obviously the, the VFL boys went on to win the flag as well and Craig McCray's a great, great man, great coach, so I had a really enjoyable couple of weeks and then I was fortunate enough to get back into the site and play the rest of the year up on the wing and I loved every minute of it. Like you said, I just I embraced it. I just wanted to be playing footy, I, you know, didn't care where it was, I just wanted to be playing footy because, you know, I sort of felt something special brewing again this year and yeah, really lucky to have been out there on, on Saturday. You expect it to be something really big and then sort of actually really quiet and just normal. Like it sounds funny, but it's really normal probably up until the Friday when you go to the parade and obviously the open training out here with you know heaps of people. I'm not sure how many rocked up, but pretty much the place was full to the brim so it's funny but completely normal up until the Friday and then obviously the parade and all that sort of stuff it's pretty special something we we just embraced again as a group similar to 2017 you know not not seeing anything as a burden or something that's going to affect our preparation or anything like that but just something that we're really lucky to be, to be involved in you know the sun was shining bright in the first quarter and it was pretty hot early and I remember blowing up a few times and I was absolutely buggered thinking this is going to be a tough game tough day got Got hit hard a few times, there was a lot of tackling, a lot of pressure. Late in that, in that first quarter we sort of kicked those couple of goals and just started to create a little bit of scoreboard pressure on them and then things went pretty well our way and you know, it's really enjoyable to be able to play a game when sort of, you, know, you never quite let yourself think too far ahead but you kind of know you're in control of the game and you can enjoy the moment a little bit. It was pretty funny, I said to Shorty about halfway through the last quarter, I sort of looked at him and said, mate, you're a premiership player now and he sort of looked at me and he goes, shut up stay concentrated. So yeah, that was pretty funny, but yeah, like I said, it was just, it was just really fun to be out there. You know, in comparison to with it, you know, it had it been a close game like last year with um, West Coast and Collingwood, so yeah, it was nice to be able to take it all in and, and just really enjoy it. The ball had just been bounced and I was on the wing, so I sort of sprinted in and I think it was Nank, Dion, Koch and Shedder. Those boys had already sort of jumped on each other, so I just jumped on and we had a bit of a stacks on and then I remember Artie getting out there, I don't know how he got out there so quick, but next thing Artie was, I was cuddling Artie on the ground and it was so good though to see all, all the boys out there with their jumpers on, it was pretty special.